basically today I have decided to do a kind of like makeup look using the uh, Smashbox Full Exposure palette. I've had this palette for a while and I really like it. I still haven't hit pan on it. So I haven't used it all that often but I really like the colors in here. I think it would be a really cute kind of like everyday fall look. Um, so uh, yeah, let's go ahead and get into the vid uh, video. I really do hope that you guys like this video. I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. Hydrating Face Primer. I'm applying on the this area where I tend to have a little bit bigger pores and on my chin. And then just in general areas that my face likes to dry. I'm going to go in with my L'Oreal um, Infallible Foundation and this is in the color 108. My chin area, so I've been breaking out, as you can see, my face has been breaking out severely and I'm thinking it's because um, of the hair products that I've been using on my hair lately. I'm going to go in with a beauty blender. This one is actually from Walgreens, it actually broke in half so I was like, oh, you know, don't want to have to go out and get another one just yet because this one works perfectly fine. And I'm just going to go ahead and dab that foundation into my skin using um, dabbing motions. I'm not going to swirl it around because it will actually move the foundation. I don't want that so I'm just dabbing it in so I can get the best coverage out of the foundation. After I have my foundation on, I'm going to go ahead and conceal my under, under eyes. Now I don't really have bad dark circles, I just want to lighten it a little bit. So I'm going to go ahead and use my Maybelline Anti-Age Instant Age Rewind in the color Neutralizer. And then I'm just going to use a tiny bit of this concealer um, from Maybelline as well. And this is the Better Skin Concealer. in with an e.l.f. Um, blush brush. I've seen some beauty gurus here on YouTube using it to set their um, under eye area and I was like, hi, Melissa, why don't you uh, go uh, try that out too? I'm going to go ahead and set the rest of my face. I'm going to be using my Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless and I'm going to be using a fluffy, fluffy round brush. I'm actually going to go in and use my Maybelline, the neutralizer one, and I'm going to apply that onto my eyelid and a little bit on my, above my crease, kind of like on my hood because I do have hooded eyes. I'm going to be using this um, light color here to set it. I'm going to go in with the second color over on the warm side. So after I go in with that shade, I'm gonna go in with the next one and that's like a medium brown. What I'm gonna go ahead now and do is apply a shimmer color onto my lid 
portion and I'm really thinking about going in with this medium oh this medium color right here and I'm gonna go ahead and go in with the darkest brown on the warm side apply the medium brown color that's close to the end of the warm side on the palette. I'm going to be using my Lights, Lights Camera Lashes from Tarte. This is my all-time favorite mascara of all times. I purchased this on my birthday and fell in love with it. I'm gonna go ahead and go back into my contour kit from NYX. This is a really, really great contour kit. If you're looking for something that's affordable, definitely pick up this NYX contour kit. I'm actually gonna go in with the lightest contour shade right here just to bronze up my face a little bit. I'm not sure what um, blush I want to use. I really, really love my Kat Von D blushes, so I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, use my Kat Von D blush. This is in the color Truth, and this is how it looks like. It's just this really nice, uh, cool toned, kind of like a cool pink mauve color. I'm going to go ahead and highlight a little bit, and to highlight, I'm going to use the Shade and Light Contour Kit. Shade and Light Contour Kit, just kidding. The NYX, I'm going to use the NYX Contour Kit, and I'm going to use this, um, this kind of like champagne color. Oh, this one, this champagne color mixed a little bit with this lighter champagne color. I don't know. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and line my lips. Oops, my lips. If you could see my desk right now, it is super messy. Super, super messy. Then I'm going to go in with my Wet n Wild lipstick and color dark wine. I love my I'm like a wine person. Alright guys, so that pretty much wraps up today's video, kind of like a chit chat, get ready with me video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it, so yeah, I, I like it, I like it a lot. It was a lot of fun filming this video, it took off a lot of stress off of my shoulders. I can't wait to get this video up so you guys can see it. Um, I am looking at filming more consistently, um, but there's still just a couple of things that I have to get, like my external hard drive. Um, so that way I'm not deleting my videos. Um, so after that, hopefully I'll be able to upload more consistently and hopefully I want to be able to get two videos up a week and hopefully try for three, but two videos up a week for you guys. Um, so yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys all in my very next video. Bye.